Hey everybody, uh, we've already been live for like 20 minutes, but this is this year's uh, birthday stream. I'm 28 now, and I had no idea going into this what I even felt like playing, and what I felt like playing in the end was Smackdown vs. Raw 2006, because I haven't in forever. Uh, I've been toying with camera settings all morning, and I think I have it looking passable. At least the audio focus isn't freaking out like it was when I was testing earlier today, and the bitrate's better than before, although... It didn't like getting scaled down very much, um, but I have like a filtering thing on now that gets some of the weird jagged edges out a little bit. Now if I switch camera to this, that looks way nicer, but when you squish it down, it doesn't always know how to cleanly squish it down, you know? Uh, so I had to put like a filter on it for that. Or else when I would get really still, my beard would look super weird and flickery. It doesn't so much on this full screen thing. But anyway, we're, we're just goofing off and playing video games and having fun for as long as we want. Oh yeah, I assume I'm gonna get like ID claimed for all of the music in this game. Uh, <laughs> and that like none of this is gonna get monetized. I don't care, whatever, it's my birthday, let's have fun. Uh, Sabu is sleeping on the table right now. If he wakes up, I'll, I'll hold him up and you can see him. I'll warn you now, most of the music in this game is terrible. Oh, I haven't played this in so long. This is like my childhood. Oh, I just wanted to play a fun game where I could read the chat a lot, you know? Okay, so I want to play just a little bit of the challenge mode, but I think it wasn't until 2007 that you could like directly go into challenges. So I'll have to remember the controls a little too. So amateur ones are mostly like stuff that's going to happen anyway. I want to do a lot of Rising Star ones, so you guys might have to remind me of some of these, see if we can get a lot done in one go, you know? So, overcome the odds, receive two or more finishers and win the match. Ooh. No limb damage, yeah. Fulfill your fantasy, right? I'll have to do some fulfill your fantasy matches, which are incredibly stupid. Win an Iron Man match with a score of five or more, uh, difficulty normal, match rules any. Okay. No finisher, no storing a finisher. Ooh. Casket match or throwback? Oh yeah, I used to play this so, so much with my friends back in the day. When you FaceTime uh, your wife and baby, your beard looks staticky. Yeah, yeah, I was getting a little bit of that from the squishing of the camera earlier. Rope break challenge, when a yeah, perform no rope breaks, okay. Confined, don't leave the ring, okay. Okay, we can get a few of these banged out in one match probably, right? I need some of you guys to do me a flavor and try to just like write down a few of these that we could do all in one match and then remind me once I get in. And I'll just like ask, like, okay, what else can we do in this match, you know? Let's get a few of these going in one go. All right, uh, so let's just remind a few. Confined, don't leave the ring, no rope breaks, don't use a finisher, don't store a finisher. Those are four we could all do in regular matches. And take no limb damage, sure. Is this uh, one of the games where you can play the game just like career with a superstar? Yeah, you could do that in a lot of these old PlayStation 2 ones. I've got the game emulating okay right now. Um, it shouldn't be too blurry. It should look fairly nice. It's about the, the best I can make it look right now without... Um... Oh, right. This was the last game with Christy Hemi. Um, thanks for all the happy birthday wishes, by the way. All right. Uh... I, oh, we got us a Chris Benoit. I think this might have been the last, no, right. He was in Smantiverse around 2007, just barely. Because it released like right before and you couldn't just patch things out so easily back then. Not all the consoles had internet access, you know? PS2 did, but most people didn't have online hooked up. Oh man, I think this is the only uh, wrestling game with uh, Robert Conway in it. I think it's also the only one with, uh, Sylvan Granier. This is probably the last one with Rene Dupree. Or it could be Dave Reckoning 2. Which one came out first? I don't remember. I don't remember. Last one was Spike Dudley. Last one was Stevie Richards, who's my favorite wrestler. I'll play him. Even though his, um, if I remember right, he's got some of the worst stats. I don't really care who I fight. I'll just release Paul London. Sure, he probably has really high reversal stat actually so this might be a bit of a bitch and I think the emulator might make it have an earthquake every single time uh during like an entrance or a loading screen or something 
because it'll it's going to be flicking between different blending modes automatically. So, what are you going to do? Ooh, you can see, like, it's slightly blurry in this mode. Yeah. During entrances, it's a little blurry. If I just skip that. I want to get into a match. Your first wrestling game? This is an old one. Old PlayStation 2 one. That was pretty good. Are stable entrances in this game? I'm pretty sure. Which you prefer, SmackDown or Raw? Oh, it completely depends on the year, I guess. It changes often what I prefer. Oh, test of strength. Okay, this is a timing minigame. Okay, I nailed that one. Got that one. Got that one. So we start with an advantage there. It's not much, though. I'm gonna have to try and remember uh, my L2 and my R2, which is which on the reversals. I believe it's L2 for... Whoa! Nope. Ma uh, that was a Mahistral Cradle. There we go. Okay, so we don't want to leave the ring. Uh, preferably don't take... Get out of my way, ref. Ooh. Perfect. What difficulty? Normal, which is all that's needed for these achievements. Reach into your chest and uh, rotate your beating heart. I think that's a pretty solid finisher. I don't feel like you'd kick out of that. I gotta remember uh, the... There's certain patterns the AI likes to do. Two strikes into a grapple is a common one. Ooh, I keep thinking that right trigger is grapple and left- or, sorry, right trigger is strike, left trigger is grapple, but it's the other way around. I gotta remember that. Right! This was back in the day when it was down and strike usually to throw a drop kick. That was so weird, but the early SmackDown vs. Raw games were like, that's a rope break. Okay, that's- that's one, uh... One achievement, I guess you would call it. One challenge I won't get done for this map. Now, if I remember, down and grapple are all submission ones. Up and grapple is signature. Ooh. Perfect. And I believe we're set to face. So diving moves should help us get a lot of momentum. There we go. Now, there's an achievement for no finisher, but I'm not going to get that one now. Because there's also an achievement for... Oh, hey, look! Uh, emulator glitch there. Beautiful. Uh, I think I can actually turn off... I think it's if I turn camera cuts off? I don't know. There might be an option in the options for that specific thing. Right, stam this was the first game with stamina, I forgot. Yeah, sure, jump at me, buddy. Ooh, that didn't work out. There we go. Love your Pokemon videos, thank you. Thanks for all the happy birthday wishes, everybody. I appreciate it. I don't think this is just a match anymore, Cole. This is getting personal. Well, what do you expect? Now, I think it's uh, three finishers in one match is one of the easy challenges, I think. PlayStation 2 emulators are always so weird. Yeah, it's not quite like a uh, dolphin, you know? Dolphin emulates very cleanly. Surprised you went for a straight there. God, I haven't gotten a successful reversal. The whole map, uh, the whole, um, I almost said map. The whole, uh, match so far. Come on. Oh. In fairness, I am playing, there we go. I'm playing a character with, uh, fairly low stats. So, my reversal timing is a little bit difficult. Currently in Cape, uh, Breton. Waiting out a, s a tropical storm. That's interesting. Hope you're okay. Hope there's no damage to the house or anything. Here we go! There's actually a unique animation for Stevie Richards' uh, vertical suplex there. Oh, that's the one to the neck breaker. Does he also have the one into the suplex? I might actually be able to get a pin with that. Damn. London chant. Ooh. Fuck, that's another achievement we can't get this map then. 
Sting in the game? Uh, no, he's from WCW. He would have been in TNA at this time. And that should paralyze him. Oh, nope. Completely botched the, uh, Palancha there. Nope. I gotta be careful about stamina. There he goes. Oh, no, I'm not gonna be able to get him in time. Ooh, Inzagiri, nice. There we go. Oh, yeah! Got him with a diving clothesline there. I didn't think I was gonna hit him with that. Holy shit, that was a quick win. Look at that. Okay, uh, without storing a finisher and rope break, break challenge, okay. I guess there's no rope break on pinfalls. I guess it doesn't count submissions. Okay, that's two down. Let's try and get a few more in this matchup just so we don't have to go through too many more loading screens, you know? This was a serious game for group night in school. Yep. I used to play this a lot with my friends. All right. Oh, forgot there's no range on that. Whoa! I forgot if you reverse the drop kick, sometimes they like spin around in this game. You wish the old Smash vs. Raw games would get a re-release? It probably can't because they wouldn't have the rights to a lot of the wrestlers anymore. Because they do have to pay royalties for the appearance of all the wrestlers. He was probably not in range there. Get some basic holds in. Get some damage in early. Okay. Let's see if we can get a win here without a finisher and without going out of the ring. That'd be another two. The two Oblivion challenges are fucking awesome. Thank you. Ooh, no range on that. Okay. Ah, oh, crap. I thought he was going for a running strike there. Ooh. <laughs> yeah, Ben will be a challenge to get around. Yeah. They would have to modify the roster heavily, and no one wants that. Ooh! Right, that's like the no-range elbow drop. Right, I don't- I can store it. Sure. I just can't use it. If I want that one challenge, at least. Let's get that neck breaker in. That's one of our signature moves. Does more damage. There we go. Ooh. Yeah, sure, climb up there, buddy. How well is that gonna go for you? There we go. How do you steal a finisher again in this game? Does anybody remember? Because I know that's one of the uh, goals. Ooh. Jesus Christ, he's really on top of me here. I forgot how hard the old ones were. Ooh. Know nothing about wrestling? Watching you play it is entertaining. Happy you like it. L1 and triangle? Uh, I don't know. I think it might be holding... Oof. I don't know. It, it feels like it has to do with the shoulders, though. Because Triangle doesn't have anything to do with uh, the finisher button in these games. Boom! Tried to catch me in a Hurricanrana. Caught him in a powerbomb. Holy shit, I thought that was it there. L2 and L1? Ooh, that might be it. Oh. Oh, I tried to take his head off with that Larry. Oh, God. Right, I forgot the wheel kick was a common move back in uh, these games. And it would often cause bleeding. Nope. Oh, he's got a lot of momentum. What would his finishers be in this game? Uh, shooting Star Press and 450? Oof. 
Don't let him store his finisher. Ah. Oh, cutter. <laughs> Holy shit. Ah. Uh, I don't know. I don't know. That felt like a three count right there. I'm pretty sure I heard that hand hit three before I saw the kick out. Ooh, referee might have been fucking on me there. What was that? <laughs> yeah. Yeah, fuck this guy. Ref should probably pull me off. I'm stomping the shit out of him in the ropes there. Oh, Jesus. Ass over tea kettle on that. Ooh. Fuck. Nope. Get away from him. He's the high flyer. There we go. Right into a lariat. Come on. Fuck. He's good. Ooh. Oop. Whiffed that one. Oh, nope. Fuck. <laughs> I blew that opportunity. Oh, my stamina's bad. Fuck. Keep him down. Wear on the arm a bit. Do some damage. Oh, get some stamina. Our stamina's bad. All right, rip his arm, arms out of his socket. If I were to be a wrestler whose style, style would you draw inspiration from? A lot of people, but I would genuinely want to be, uh, or generally want to be very basic in my moves and instead just have all the flair be in character stuff and the crispness of the moves. That's what I've always liked. So I'm thinking people like uh, Brian Myers, you might know him as Kurt Hawkins. He's a good example of that, just making the little things big. Uh, William Regal was like that. Nick Aldis is like that. That's kind of what I've always been the most into. Oh! Oh my god, my foot was on the rope. That was a dragon suplex. That could have pinned me. Take him down. Oh, my foot was on the rope. That was the only reason I got out there. That was a three count. If you do a Halucha only Pokemon challenge in Maria Mysterio, uh, probably not gonna do a Halucha only challenge. Reels in this game? Yes. Oh, front face lock. Oh my god. Oh, his foot's on the rope. Fuck. If his foot was on the rope there, I could have gotten him to tap. Yeah, I've seen the new game. I, I haven't seen much of it, though. Mostly the commercials. I think they sent it to me, but I haven't played it yet. Ooh. There we go! He walked right into that! <laughs> oh, I thought that was it! <sighs> Going to another YouTuber stream for his birthday as well? Well, wish him a happy birthday for me. I made him bleed! That might be it. Ah, oh, his foot's under the rope. Alright, let go. Ref is a paid actor. Yeah, ref is fucking on me. Okay, get... Mm. Do you watch uh, AW? Every episode. Oh, man. He is brutal. I gotta get back in the swing of this. Forgot how hard these uh, old ones used to be. Oh, 
Okay, good thing he's bleeding, because it does actually slow him down often. It's why he often is just, like, holding his head in pain rather than capitalizing when he takes me down. It's because of the bleeding. There we go. Battlegrounds is played by microtransactions. Is it actually, though? Or or is this like the other last few games where they said it was and it literally doesn't have microtransactions? People just misunderstood some screenshots. Ugh. Away. Away. Is Edge in the game? Yes. There we go. Okay, put him down, put him down. There we go. That's what pinned him last time, a diving clothesline. There we go. There's fake money that can be bought with real money. Okay, yeah, that's annoying then. But, do you actually have to do that, or can you get it at a reasonable pace in-game? Because if you can get it at a re reasonable pace in-game, then... Who cares? Is Nathan Jones in the game? I, you, Australia's greatest wrestler of all time, Nathan Jones? Uh, unfortunately, I'm sorry to disappoint you, Nathan Jones didn't make it in any game. <laughs> what was it, what was his nickname again in, in that short-lived Australian promotion that sucked? Um... Front Row Nathan Jones, that was it. I never got that name, Front Row Nathan Jones. What does that mean? It vaguely sounds like Big League, but front- Like he's in the front- or Like he bought a ticket to the show? He's not the star attraction, he purchased a ticket? Am I misunderstanding this? Is Orlando Jordan in this? I believe so. Also, congratulations, you are now hearing the only good menu music in the game. It's pretty good. What's up, uh, man from Wales? I got a few people from Wales. My name is from Wales. Big Dick Nathan Jones. Yeah, that was his nickname. <laughs> okay, we've already got four challenges cleared. Hell yeah. Slobber knocker challenge. Pass the number one score in slobber knocker. Okay. <laughs> Front row Nathan Jones. Win an Iron Man match by five or more scores. That's an... Did they mean points? Weird way to word that. My son wanted me to hop in there and say happy birthday. That's awesome. Say he's also Canadian. That's great. Uh, no limb damage. That's hard. Some of these challenges are hard. Receive two or more finishers and win the match. I, res I took one finisher in that match. Tag match. Tag your partner five or more times and win the match. That's easy. Yeah, let's just get that one knocked out of the way early. Oh, and it skipped the good song. Damn. <laughs> Five more scores. So weird, right? No, I want a uh, tag match, yeah. Uh, I'll control both. Uh, nah. AI can control my partner. Who will I be? I just need to win a match. Let's just be anyone. Who who would be fun? Who'd be fun? Wait, hold on. Uh is this Carlito before the backstabber? Is this when he had the overdrive? Yes it is. He's only got the overdrive. Ooh, that's that's a rare Carlito right there. Now we gotta team up with John Cena. You remember that feud Carlito had? Where Carlito's friend Jesus stabbed John Cena in the kidney? That was an actual storyline in 2005, if I remember right. Uh, who, who do we want to be against? Oh, Snitsky? Vin now, is this pre-Big Boot Snitsky? This is pre-Big Boot Snitsky. Okay. And JBL, sure. On Velocity! Uh, use the purchase currency to unlock wrestlers, but if you don't have to use that, you gotta grind it out for hours to unlock. For example, I think Brock Lesnar costs two, uh, 120,000, 200... 
English is hard. 120,000, uh, you get about 200 per match. Oh, fuck, that sucks. Was it an actual st- No. <laughs> no, they did not actually stab John Cena in the kidney for this wrestling storyline. <laughs> Look, wrestlers are very dedicated to their craft. They're not so dedicated that they're willing to be stabbed in the kidney. It's a bit much. God, I wish JBL wasn't a total piece of shit. There's always mixed things when you hear wrestlers talk about JBL. You always hear that he was a bully, but you also hear that he was kind of tragic and insecure. But then again, when you listen to modern JBL just talk sometimes off the cuff, he's very defensive about fans. And I don't mean defensive like he doesn't like fans thinking he's a bully. I mean, he's very protective of wrestling fans, which I isn't the kind of thing you'd expect from a guy like that. Just goes to, to show that people are more complicated than you think, you know? He is very adamant that the use of Mark when referring to fans is just an outright insult. And he gets very angry when people call fans Marks. Um, which I thought is really cool of him. Uh, he's very, very adamant that you need to be respectful to the fans. Because they're the whole reason that wrestling is what it is. And I just thought that's really cool. At least that's what he said on a pre-show once. So, who knows? I haven't met the guy. But, you know, just a little little food for thought, saying that perhaps it's more complicated. I do love the JBL character, though. And I love him as a wrestler. Just immediately punchy a bunch of times in the nose, Snitsky. Now, Snitsky probably has a terrible reversal stat. Immediately hitting diving elbow drops. Oh! Okay, strong start. He has me outweighed by a little bit, though. I don't know if you can tell from the size of him. Fucking... Ah! Fucking... Ref! Ref! Thank you, Ref! Fuck. <laughs> oh, wow, I can actually lift him. Oh, fuck. Damn it. <laughs> There we go. Oh. Oh shit. Oh. Is this game emulator? Uh, easy to play over par. Easy to play over parsec. Yeah, it's a PlayStation 2 emulator. So it should be easy to play over parsec, as far as I can think of. About the time the blue mini got his ass beat by JBL. Yeah, that's why I said complex human being. There's, there's, there's. Two sides to everything, you know. MW, how do you describe wrestling to people who don't know wrestling at all? Uh, it's, it's what if shonen at live action shonen anime was good. In fact, um, a lot of early manga was inspired by professional wrestling. Okay, I've tagged out. By the way, scene is legal in the match, and well, scene is legal. I think I'll just. Uh, Hold on, was this back in the days where control type? No, I want targeting. No, that's targeting indicators. Mm, was there was there a button that, whoops. <laughs> was there a manual button to switch target? I think this is before you could have manual and auto on simultaneously. So if I do mm, that, there we go. Just beating up JBL on the outside a little. Taking him out of the match, you know? Alright, alright. Right, getting on the apron was different back in these days. There we go. Back to my corner, I'll watch a little bit. Let's see how Cena does. Cena's the high stats guy here, so I'm sure he'll be fine. Especially against Snitsky. Snitsky's all damage and power. Not great at much else. Because this gives me a chance to read the chat a little more. Gonna redeem this, explain the term. Mark when he used to rest. Oh yeah, other people might find that useful. Mark has many, many meanings though. Uh, even within wrestling itself. I have plenty of wrestling fans or friends, and uh, I also learned Carney because I wanted to. Uh, yeah, Mark has many meanings within wrestling itself. It's evolved a lot over the years. 
its its origins are a little derogatory, its current use is a little derogatory, but it's not always strictly derogatory. It's a complex word, as most things are. You know, uh, how you're using it matters a lot more than the word itself, like most things in English. R1 has changed target. I think it's, uh, oh, fuck, come on. <laughs> I'm just gonna... Ah! Well, the ref's distracted. There we go. <laughs> Get over here. I've watched Shark Side of the Ring every episode. Fun show. Ow. Get out of my out of my way. I don't even know who's legal right now. Is it JBL? JBL, get in the ring. Fuck, I'm getting countered a lot out here. This is rough. Fucking Hey JBL, you wanna get back in the ring? There you go. Fuck you, Snitsky. Oh my god, fucking Lucha Cena! Oh. I'm just gonna, real quick. It's fine, ref doesn't care. <laughs> you can get away with so many shenanigans in, uh, in tag team matches in these games, it's great. I forget, could you even- Oh yeah, I can ask for a tag in this game, good. Thanks for all the happy birthday wishes. Yeah, take a really shit double drop kick <laughs> animation. Not the best. He's going for the submission, and he might get it. He's got Why is the referee checking him as if he's legal? I knew it was only a matter of time before we saw that. I don't like it, but as long as it wins matches, it's going to keep happening. That's the bottom line, Cole. If you're not Ooh. Anything, you can't didn't think Carlito would have a knockout punch. Tell me what the language is that MDV learned. Oh, I was actually talking about it a little on the vlog earlier. Carney. American Carney. It's just like a coded language, like Pig Latin, for instance, is uh, a similar kind of thing. It's an old carnival language. Very stiff Samoan drop there. Stiff as in, like, stiff animation. There we go. Double team challenge. Nice. There we go. I'm just gonna... Ah, oh, he countered my finisher. Damn. Let's hoping I can get an overdrive on Snitsky on the outside. Get my stamina back. We weren't gonna win it there anyway. It's the ref trying to break this up. Oh, that was messy looking. I think that was a flatliner, but the heights didn't match up so well. Old game. Old game. Doesn't always look the cleanest, you know? Yes, WWE did have a wrestler called Kazarni. That was Sin Bodhi. Uh, although, I think he only had two SmackDown matches before he was released. Which is a shame, because I've seen him on the indies. He's a good wrestler. Alright, tag me, Cena. There we go. Fuck. Ooh. Camera's fucking with me there, too. Uh, rope break? My foot's on the rope. Rope break. JBL's a- oh, come on. Cena. Cena, get in here. Fuck. Have you watched Up, Up, Down, Down, Battle of the Brands? Yeah, good show. I haven't been watching the most recent season of it, but I watched all of the first season. Fuck, our momentum is dead. Jesus Christ. Yeah, my momentum already is stopped dead. Fuck. God damn it, Snitsky. Ah, I bailed. Don't you fucking get on me, Snitsky. You're not even legal. Oh, 
fans and all of sports entertainment. All right, JBL, get in here. Oh, okay, okay, don't let him store finisher. Fuck. Oh, fuck, he's getting me with the power bomb. This might be it. Cena. C Cena. Okay, he's giving me time. Cena's distracting the ref. Oh, God. Wow. Wow. Even with the distraction, JBL's powerbomb fucking killed me. All right. We got the achievement, though. That's all that matters. It's a good thing your partner's the invisible man. Yeah, invisible because he didn't fucking show up. Thanks for the help there, Cena. When is a donation displayed? Oh, I don't think they are displayed. I'm supposed to get informed of them over here, but I've been getting such a barrage of message of uh, notifications. I haven't seen them. Thanks for the the $3. Happy birthday. Love your Pokemon challenges. Greeting from Germany. Have a great day. Thank you. I got a bunch of German fans. That or I just have very vocal German fans. Been almost a full year since he dropped birthday bits. I guess it makes sense because he would have to be on my birthday, right? Uh, what was I gonna? Slobber knocker, right? I need to beat the slobber knocker record, and I need to win a Iron Man match by more than five points, right? Let's do an Iron Man one. We'll do a ten minute one. Ooh, can I get that many points in ten minutes? You know what? Let's try fifteen minutes. 15 minute Iron Man match, can I get five more points than the other guy in that time limit? That's hard. Think that was the wrong challenge you got? No, Iron Man. Iron Man's good. Thanks for all the happy birthday wishes, everybody. Did I not get the right one? Maybe. I can always jump back into that one. Maybe I got one of the lower difficulty ones. Master Lock. That wouldn't be great for... Well, maybe. Stats aren't amazing. Christian with the unprettier. Christian is fun. Hmm, decent enough stats. The Bashams! I like the Bashams. They were good. No one remembers them fondly but me, though. Ooh, you know what? Eddie Guerrero, he'd be good. Oh yeah, he was a heal at this time. I'm gonna go clean, just because his moveset is kind of better suited for that. Uh, let's have someone vaguely the same-ish stats as me. Someone in the 80s, you know? Not Doug and Danny, that's a bit low. Uh, you know what? JBL, yeah. JBL's hard as fuck, and they had a great feud. We'll do, uh... It's a cool arena. Oh wait, this is the first WWE game with an ECW arena. And they actually did an okay job at it, too. On Heat, <laughs> the B Show. Actually, this is more like the D Show. Edge has similar stats. Oh yeah, could have done Edge. I think Edge probably has a higher reversal rate, which is like the reversal rate is the worst thing for the AI to have in this game. It's so awful. All right, all right, we got to win by five or more points, right? That's that's pretty hard. We got fifteen minutes. Maybe you should stream Banner Lord every fourth week of CK3. I'd rather just stream whatever I'm in the mood for. It keeps the streams funner. This is 2006, right? Yeah. Well, SmackDown vs. Raw 2006 came out in 2007, though. So by SmackDown vs. Raw... Uh, I failed that. By SmackDown vs. Raw 2007, he was dead, and he was considered, like, a legend in the game by that point. They put him in the legend section. Now, I think he's enough weight classes above me that I might not be able to lift him. Ah! I wasn't quick enough on that. How common are male versus female matches in WWE? Um, literal male versus females and they hit each other. Um, those have been banned in WWE because of their the toy company they're with doesn't allow that because television broadcasting rules. Uh, and so that hasn't been a actual thing they're allowed to do in a very, very long time outside of very, very solemnly in pay-per-views. I'm talking like once every few years on pay-per-view. 
There are many wrestling promotions in the world, though, that have intergender wrestling. Because, you know, it's it's a work, so... Well, that was not my best dive, but whatever. You know, it's 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 a it's a work, so it doesn't matter if, you know, men and women have you know, men have an unfair advantage in combat sports against women because it's not a combat sport, it's theater, you know? So you could go either way on that. But T V broadcasting rights usually say can't show it, you know? Greens are Bolivia. That's awesome. I don't have many Bolivian fans. Three amigos. There we go. Oof. I gotta use my speed advantage here. Oh, I thought I timed that well. There we go. Jesus! That animation was in the game for a long time. Forget about the years of training and sacrifice that went into their careers. Uh, question related to donations playing on the screen. There's a feature you can do in Streamlands, for example. Yeah, I had that for years. It was fucking annoying. That's why we stopped using it. It really distracts from the stream and the game. Honestly, I'd rather people just don't donate to me at this point. It uh, takes away from the stream at some level, and I just don't need the money. Save the money for yourself. It's COVID. What if your family needs it, you know? Are you playing season mode or free play? Uh, free play. Also, are you playing, uh, also are you WW2K Battlegrounds? I'm guessing you mean, are you gonna play? Uh, I don't know. I have no idea. There we go. Oh, Jesus. Lucha JBL. <laughs> Fuck, I could have sworn I got the timing on that one. Might get backlash for what? For, for saying don't donate to me? <laughs> oh, thanks for the $10 there, uh, Touch Smasher. I, I don't know if that was related to what I just said. Happy birthday, first time watching this stream in two years, wow. You know, um, it, it's funny that you say first time watching in two years. Me and Fatima recently have been playing, just in our own spare time, we've been playing The Escapist 2 together, and one of the guards in that game is named after you. Um, or no, it was one of the prisoners, I think. I think it's like Fatima's roommate in the game. I don't remember. I remember finding your channel through Dawn of War. That's awesome. That was a long time ago. Trying to wear down some body parts. I, I figure I could probably get a lot of submission victories fairly easily, right? God, it's hard to keep people down for diving moves in this game. That uh, All Stars is nuts. All Stars looks like fun. It, it was made uh, by the same people who made uh, the TNA game, and that was a fun one. Fuck, Jesus. There we go. Kick out his ankle. Oh, real quick before he can stop me. <laughs> and I think he got all that finisher is what King had to say about that. I haven't gotten a single fucking pinfall, by the way. This is really bad. I don't think I'm winning this one. It's harder than I remembered. They get up so goddamn fast. From, for like, anything in this game. How do you get diving moves in? Oh my god. The classic taunt and get bodied, yeah. Now that's not my taunt. That that was like just part of the game's animation for that. Oh fuck, is this a power bomb? Oh, I do There we go, I made him bleed. Here we go. What? Are you crazy? It's just getting good, JR. And float over. Don't waste time. We have a time limit here. Do some damage to that arm. No kidding. This will rearrange your anatomy. Didn't do much, but it did something. Here we go. Straight jacket. Choke him out. Oh. Oh my god. We could get a tap out here. Yeah. That's our first point. 
There we go, there we go. I mean, I could just destroy Scotty Toddy with Triple H, but I feel like that'd be, uh... I don't know, I like the difficulty, you know? Come on! Ah, oh, he got the ropes. Damn it. So maybe I could tap him out there and get another quick point. Trying to go for a lot of submissions right now. He's not so good at those. Ah, oh, fuck, he's on the rope. Hi from Australia. You don't need to calf suck. What nationality is your wife? That's a weird question. She's from Iraq, though. But, like, nationality, uh, Canadian, like, now. Oh, for fuck's sake. I mistimed that grapple. There we go. Got him on the ground. Fast, 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 fast. Oh, come on, come on, come on. Oh, fuck. <laughs> How am I ever supposed to hit that goddamn frog splash? The worst part is it's a really good move if you land it. Oh. Oh, pin him, pin him, pin him. Oh, okay, that's point two, that's point two. Okay, take him down fast, take him down fast. Get in the corner. What a big move. Fuck. Damn it. Damn it. How's that not a rope break? Come on, I could reach. There. Okay, but to say happy birthday. Thanks! Get in the corner. Get in the corner. He took the turnbuckle pad off, that motherfucker. Ooh. That was a challenge, cool. Get in the corner. Fuck! Would... You? Oh, he raked the eyes, motherfucker. Oh, I hit the ref a bit there. Get him in a leg lock. There we go, STF. Do not let him store his finisher. Fuck, fuck, fuck. Ah, um, game? There we go, there we go, we're good. Ooh. Yeah, his stamina just ran out. Get in the corner. Fuck, he can't. He collapsed. Oh. He's out of stamina. Good. Get in the fucking corner. There we go. Okay, that's got to keep him down long enough for the frog splash. Oh my god, he's moving! Holy shit. Well, apparently that was a challenge even though I missed all of them. Good to know. Just don't do Eddie's frog splash. <laughs> Simply doesn't keep them down long enough. Lasso from El Paso. I'll use that instead next time. Fuck. Get, get over here. These superstars are putting on a great match so far, JR. But if they drop the ball, there we go. I don't think that's gonna happen, Ah! Come on! <laughs> he countered the lasso, too. It's the fourth failed finisher. Oh. God damn. Get in this ring. Boom! <laughs> that terrible sell. Oh my god, I got the lasso, but it's on the outside. I was trying to store it, but it's the same button. <laughs> Fuck. Well, 
It'll do some damage, but I, uh, yeah, I couldn't get the pin. Or I couldn't get a point. Fuck, I don't think I'm getting this achievement. That's difficult. Alright, let's see if we can get a pin off this. Game of Lich and difficulty must be awful. It is unplayably hard. Oh my god, we got another pin. Okay. Oh, we need quick pins. Quick pins. Come on. Oh! Come on! We're three points! We have three minutes! Oh my god, we got another one! Holy shit, we might actually get this. Yeah, get away from those ropes. Get away from those ropes. Kick out his knee. Fuck. Fuck, fuck. Pump handle slam. That's a big power move. Oh. Good, he's selling in the concussion. Juke him out there. He's got a fucking weapon. Let him hit me with the weapon! Give me a point, give me a point! Got a point for DQ! Yes! Yeah, use that weapon as much as you want, buddy. Oh, we hit the ref with that! Yeah, sure. <laughs> yes! Is he gonna pin me? He just gave me three points! He can't possibly catch up. He's clearly frustrated and giving up the match, I love it. Oh, Jesus, he's laying those in. I think I had such a point lead on me. He gave up and just- Oh, he took my head off with the clothesline from hell. That's a fucking pin. Oh, yeah, that was a legit pin he got on me there with the clothesline from hell. Fuck. Northern Lights. There we go. Oh, that messed us up. Oh. Fuck, fuck. Oh, now that our head is really wounded, we keep selling the concussion like he does. Gives you a lot of downtime when you get up. If you regenerate your stamina, you can temporarily get rid of that, but it will come back. There we go. Oh, I went for the lasso again. It's trying to get more points, you know? Come on. In the corner. Fuck, big boot. Oh, he's doing his power bomb. I gotta like pause and unpause to get rid of that visual glitch. Okay, I'll still win by five points or more if I get pinned here. Oh my god, I got up in time. Fucking bail. There. Yeah, yeah. There we go. We're good, we're good. Yeah, he can just taunt out there, that's fine. Oof. Okay, no, we're good. Whoa, whiffed that. He, why is he bailing on me? <laughs> I got him with a headbutt to the- with the back of my head, to the back of his head. An amazing move. I keep getting the lasso, but I'm only getting on the outside. Whatever, doesn't matter. Run at the clock with this. Here we go. We win! <laughs> yeah, Eddie with a 10-foot vertical leap. There we go. 10 grapple uh, reversals, 3 finishers, overcome the odds, and Iron Man challenge. There we go. That was a lot of them there. The clonk sound effect is fantastic. Yeah.
Oh, that was a good match. Okay, what else do we need to do? We need to do slobber knock, right? Oh, hey, Truth. Truth, I was telling them about the Oblivion Challenge we want to do. I, I think I'm going to be ready to start on that tomorrow, if you still are. Um, today, when I get back to work after the stream, I plan on finishing one of the challenges today. And that'll finally give me enough time to start on that Oblivion one. It's going to be a fucking mess. Me and Truth want to try and beat Elder Scrolls Oblivion with two dudes on one keyboard. So, like, we'll be using Parsec, he'll use the keyboard, I'll use the mouse, and we need to beat the game. It's gonna be some goofy fun. I'm gonna make a whole video about it. So for the challenge, I think we can do it. I'm confident we can do it. And we're gonna get a lot of funny moments out of it. I think it's gonna be a fun video. I don't know how I'm gonna edit it yet. It might be a bit of a bitch, because I can't, like, just read the script real easy on the side. Like, I can't... I, it won't be so easy to just tab out and write some in the script and blah, blah, blah. Because, you know, you'll control the keyboard for part of it. But I, I think the way I have it set up, it'll be fine. Head over for the work. That's awesome. Uh, that's awesome. Fucking, sorry. I'm mixing that up with other messages now because my eyes are blurring. Enjoy work. Thanks for coming by, Joe. I appreciate it. <laughs> Two dudes, one keyboard. Uh, right. I, let's have a fun match now. Let's just do some goofy fun. I want a slobber knocker match. Uh, ranking. That's what I'm supposed to do, right? I want to see the rank, so I need to beat a score of 30. Oh, man. Okay. Eddie has the has the record, really? I would have thought, like, Undertaker. Okay. Let's do it. That says no limit, right? This is literally just viewing. Yeah, okay. I was just making sure, for sure, there is just one mode. Okay. Okay, uh, I want to be Orton then. I feel like Randy Orton would be a good character for this. All around really good stats. 86! I thought he would have more! I think Christian has better stats than Randy Orton. Wow! Now, this was the RKO animation where he grabs from, from one side and transitions to the other side before he drops him, right? I think so. We got a young Randy Orton. Let's do it. Taboo Tuesday. That was a short-lived pay-per-view. That is only mid-2000s, kids will remember. So this is a slobber knocker match. It's a special match type in these old games where everybody you fight has super low health. And you just need to beat as many people as you can. It's kind of just like a for fun thing, you know? Booker T! Uh, uh, immediately, someone gets me with the throat chop. Ooh. Wow! Booker's getting me early here. Slobber and Arca matches, you really gotta start getting power moves in and kind of get like a, get a roll going early, you know? Get some momentum, hit finishers. There we go. Oh, that was definitely an HBK animation. That was a Steiner uh, belly to belly there. You can get three counts off real weak moves in this mode. Doug Basham, it's all over now. Doug Basham had an awesome theme. And I think I'm the only one I've ever heard say that. No one ever- Whenever I talk about old great themes, Doug Basham. And no one fucking agrees with me. Ooh, big Canadian shoulder breaker there. Is that enough for Doug Basham? Damn. Thanks for the happy birthday wishes. It's alright. You guys just can't appreciate the greatness of the Bashams. I named my Pokemon in a Pokemon challenge after Doug and Danny Basham. Okay, you know, I'm gonna actually just store that finisher for now. You really at the cabinet stable? Me too. Alright, put him down. Choke him out. Pulse on mine, and yet yeah, you got it. 
There we go. Tapped him out. God, the walk animation is so weird when you're not targeting a guy. Get my stamina back real quick. There we go. Charlie Haas? This must have been Charlie Haas's last game. I thought 2005, like, as just the original Smash vs. Raw, I thought that was his last one. Oh, man! Oh, I rolled him up immediately. Oh, shit, Benoit. He's one of the tougher guys. He's got a high reversal stat and submission. And those are scary stats to be good at. Big gut buster. Put him down, put him down. Even in slobber knocker mode, Ben was too tough for that. Here we go. Alright, I'm actually gonna use a finisher on him. There we go. Oh, I knocked him unconscious. Knocked him out with that. Drove his jaw into the mat. Big Benoit chant? <laughs> you don't hear that chant anymore, I wonder why. Fucking this is Christian's last game, right? Before, because he would have, very shortly after this game, he would have left for TNA. Became world champion. Christian as Christian Cage in TNA was awesome. The Christian Coalition, they were great. Uh, his foot's on the oh, no DQ, okay. Yeah, rope break's fine, cool. Score five, we're aiming for 51, I believe. Ric Flair. Six pack Ric Flair! Come on! He didn't have a six pack in 2005. I think Kane has a fucking six pack in this game. Fuck, chop block. He's trying to take out the knees early. We just gave Chris Ben a concussion. Oh no! Boom! Why doesn't he do that form drop anymore? I always thought that looks awesome. Ah, uh, not enough for Flair. In fairness, Flair's a fucking legend. Put him down. Drop him on his head. Hook the leg. There we go. Wow, we have 230 fucking people just for me playing a random old wrestling game. Thanks, everybody. It's Eugene! Now, was this Eugene's last game? Mm, I think he might have made it into 2007 as well. Oh, oh shit. Flair War Red, that's why he lost. Good point! Yeah, now, mind you... He didn't always wear red when he was gonna lose. That it wasn't always consistent, but that is the infamous flair thing of when he's gonna lose a big match, he wore red. Uh, but I have watched enough of his late SmackDown run to know that that was not not always true. Also, he's actually gonna do some some serious damage to my legs here. This is bad. I don't want to mess up my legs early, because if some good submission expert comes by later, we could lose thanks to that. Schoolboy, get him, get him, put him down early. Fuck, he kicked out. Oh, nope. Put him down. He missed. <laughs> oh, that'd be an embarrassing way for him to lose, wouldn't it? There we go. Stop by and have to say happy birthday. Thanks. Gonna comment any comments are good for the YouTube algorithm. Thanks. Eugene or Festus? I liked both. Mm, that didn't work out. That didn't work out. I should not have gone for that. It had the big taunt before it, too. Big drop kick. Wow, Eugene is holding on better than anyone else. Make him bleed. Oh, hey, I said Jericho out there. He didn't get knocked out? Benoit got knocked out by that! 
You love the low poly crowd? Do you love the jacked dude in the front row who's super short? He's fucking weird looking. Oh, Scotty Too Hotty! Who doesn't love Scotty Too Hotty? This was Scotty's last game. It must have been. Get him! That did not have the range I thought it would. <laughs> oh, good thing he stood there. Break his shoulder. There we go. Is the get up by Terry RKO in a mission this game? No, unfortunately not. This was Jericho's last game for a couple years, I think. Alright. Oh! Concussion! That took him straight to redhead health. Oh. Fucking rope hung DDT. Yeah. Yeah, you're not kicking out of that. So say I love your content on the Pokemon just Thank you. Maybe remember you're the greatest Nancy Drew Let's player. No one can take that from you. Thank you. I appreciate it. All right, Big Show. I probably will actually need a finisher for him. Get in the corner. There we go. Oh, top rope RKO! Yeah! That's awesome. Fuck, for a second I thought he was kind of gonna kick out. Oof. Fucking Undertaker. No selling my clotheslines here. He's just getting up. Whoa! Whoa. Fucking roll him up, roll him up! Stack him! Oh! Grab him fast! Oh, the old school Orton backbreaker. Love that move. Okay, okay. RKO. Ooh. No, no. Mm, store it, store it. We'll save that for later. Playing risky is just gonna get us in danger. Oh. There we go. I don't want him to land a hit on me. He's a high damage character, you know? Here we go. Big vertical. Of course not. Still watching Deadly Premonition 1? Spoilers are everywhere, man. I know, right? Don't... Don't look up anything Deadly Premonition if you don't want spoilers. It's scary. Don't even look up the soundtrack of the game. I always warn people about that. The official soundtrack of the game has spoilers in the song names. Nice counter! Whoa! Fucking took me down there. Okay. Stay on the mat. Oh. There we go. Ah! He countered it and didn't counter that one. Boom! Knocked out the Undertaker. He countered the first one, but I had one stored. Oh, that was scary. Paul London. Okay. Ooh. Fuck. He can make me bleed with that. Boy, it's obvious these superstars have done their homework on each other. They sure have. Love your let's plays. Thanks, man. Let's hope it's not their final exam. Choke him out, choke him out. His head's already red. Did you ever try streak mode in 2K14? Uh, yeah, that was a fun mode. It was hard. Oh. It looks like they've decided to slow the match down a bit here. And this Snitsky, okay, that's not too bad. Does a decent amount of damage with his grapples, though. But you're not going to do yourself much good in the match 
if you let yourself get bone tired either. Here's One, the cover, JR. Two. Three. Nice. Easy pin. Paul London's one of your favorites. He's great, isn't he? What's going on in the ring? Cena, shit. Some of the best stats in the game. This has gone beyond just being a match, JR. I think these superstars genuinely hate each other. There's no love lost between these. Came for the creep house to save for the rest. Oh, creep house. That was a while ago. Here we go, store that. They're taking it down a notch, JR. Okay, that might be enough for him. They're picking up Fox King. He's got his opponent in a pinning predicament. Was that three? Oh. No? Come on. <laughs> When's the next great pass to reading? Who knows? <laughs> Fucking low blow. That was just a generic reversal in this game. The first uh, non-Pokemon Let's Play I saw was L.A. Noir. That's awesome. That was a really good one. Ooh, what am I going for here? Oh, Shoulder Breaker? Yeah. Okay. I think he might actually be done. It's pretty hurt. Good. Okay, let the other guy roll in fast enough for me to hit my finisher before my momentum empties. Sorry to Jerry. <laughs> done. <laughs> Instant knockout. Love my on the spot running. Sorry to Jerry. This was to Jerry's last game. Kirby Air Ride, that was a good one. Did Jerry got fucking deleted? I know, right? Put him down. Oh my god, military press into a gut buster! Oh god. Wow! Didn't think he'd kick out of that. Was this Hurricane's last game before he became Gregory Helms? I think he was no bandana Gregory Helms in the next game, and then he was bandana Gregory Helms after that. There we go! What if I climb up this one? Hey, Ray! Boom! Dropkick right to the chin. Oh, I thought I had him. He clearly bit the ropes. Yeah, that should be a that should be a uh, fucking what's it called? <laughs> English is hard. That should be a rope break. Well, I guess there is no rope break in this match. I think it was two th it was 07 was Gregory Helms. I I think so too. I think you're right. I think that's when he had um hilarious Titantron Gregory Helms. You guys ever remember that one? Uh where it was just him and his sunglasses over and over. That was a long wind up and a lot of damage. Learning another language? Hell yeah, I'm gonna gonna before I'm 29 and today I'm 28. I'm looking forward to it. It's an exciting new thing for me. I've never been good with languages. So it's going to be really hard. And uh, I'm up for the challenge. Nice. There we go. Let's get a quick RKO on whoever comes in next. Sorry, Dupree. I love you, but you're done. This has got to be Dupree's last game, right? Just in game trade hardcode says ever. I don't know. I'm not really worrying about Pokemon challenges right now. Oh, Kane, he's tough. Yeah, he's got a six pack in this game. Roll him up, roll him up, roll him up. Oh, that would have been nice. So let's get him. Top rope R RKO. Knocked him out. Yeah. That's gotta be, that's gotta be Kane. 
Is Murdoch in this one? Ah, uh, no. Uh, um, Trevor Murdoch's first game was the next one. I'm a big Trevor Murdoch fan, though. Oh, Heindenreich? He's, he's a shoot lunatic. <laughs> is this your favorite wrestling game? Uh, Fire Pro Wrestling World is probably my favorite overall. I love you, Kao, and ask if he's the next, if this is the last game. Not related, not related that I did that. I'm getting better. I'm starting to get the pacing of the reversals a little better. Thanks for all the happy birthday wishes. All right, shoulder breaker. Take him to, actually, sh isn't the Canadian shoulder breaker Heinrich's finisher? I think it is. All right, Heidenreich's done. Heidenreich made it in a surprisingly large amount of WWE games. Roll him up. Nice! Just barely! All right, who's coming in next? You're getting an RKO. Sorry, Orlando Jordan, this was your last game, and you're unconscious. There we go. He was also an LOD. He was a very short-lived LOD gimmick. Spike Dudley, this was his last game. Unfortunately, I'm a big uh, fan of Spike Dudley. Especially his, uh, his uh, like, big evil boss Spike Dudley gimmick, which is what he is in this game. It's good. It's a good gimmick. I broke Benoit's record? Hell yeah. Knock him out. Fucking done. Nice. His work in ECW is great and terrifying. The fucking bumps that dude took. Ah, uh, yeah, first game Carlito before he had the backstabber. Choke him out. Ah, he got out early. You're absolutely right, King. We've seen many superstars tap out to this very hole. There we go. Damn. Uh, store the finisher for now. We should start having one banked more often, just for safety, you know? Finally got a stream. Stream, awesome. Happy you could make it. Roll him up. Wow. I didn't think Carlito, of all people, would kick out. Okay. Take his head off. Ooh. Lucha Orton. Oh, well. Um, not, not the best dive I've ever done. <laughs> oh, Lucha Orton's best Orton. What an elbow drop. <laughs> that was so perfect. Ah, oh, for fuck's sake. <laughs> it was a good effort. You're right, it was. It's the most ad- Oh, wow, you can see a bunch of them exposing the business out there, just not even watching. There's no room for error. Coast to coast, not even close. <laughs> that went nowhere. <laughs> I forgot when you do the low blow, you can do a standing finisher while they're already basically on the ground. Something funny about that. Oh, got me in the fucking dick with that bunch. Just, just fuck you. There we go. Guys, do you remember which game it was where there was a common glitch where the crowd, when they stood up and cheered, a bunch of their heads would spin around 360? I think it was SmackDown vs. Raw 2007. Whoa! Did the games, did the game just go to, did the game just go into widescreen? I have it set to not do widescreen. What the fuck? The game just jumped into widescreen. Okay, I'm gonna do a save state just in case like I crash the game trying to fix this. What the fuck? Video? It, okay, not, not that menu. It's fine in that menu. Uh, what happened that caused that? 
Aspect ratio widescreen, it's not... No, standard. Apply. Thank you. That was weird. How weird was that? Uh, does everything look good on stream now, everybody? If I just do that? Yeah, that looks okay. Okay, okay, I think we're good. That was weird! Yeah, I slammed him so hard, the aspect ratio changed! Wow! That only took him to yellow health. To other people, that's been taking them to red on their head. There we go. God, he's still getting up. Alright, knock him out. There we go. Sabu is so happy rolling around on my desk right now. Sorry, Sylvan Grenier. Let's take a turnbuckle pad off. Exposed metal there. We'll use that a bit. Oh, it's poor Sean Davari. They didn't use him well. I always thought he was fucking fantastic. Oh, fucking Lucha Orton. Wow, he kicked out. They never get to call matches as good as this. It's literally Orton fighting the whole roster and beating them. Yeah, this match goes until I until I lose, but I'm trying to get 50 points to beat the record, and uh, I need to beat like I need to get like 51. So we're just past the halfway point. Oh, Robert Conway, he's pretty easy. Ooh. All right. SmackDown was on Thursdays back in these days. Nowadays it's on Friday. Wasn't it 30? I thought it was uh, 50 I need. God, that belly to belly does a lot of damage. I gotta use that more. Fast and easy uh, grapple to do too. It's got a quick animation. Hey Regal. Six pack Regal. Lucha Orton! That got him to red health! Fuck. And back in the corner. Boom! Wow! That didn't knock him out? Nice. Oblivion videos made you play it again. That's awesome. I, I always love hearing that I got people back into it. Oh, I forgot that Mark Jindrak was in this game. I thought the previous game was his last one. Oh, that was messy. Can I get him with it though? Fun fact about uh, Mark Jindrak. He apparently, according to interviews with um, Nigel McGuinness, if I remember right, uh, he said that the guy who taught him how to do clotheslines as well as he does was Mark Gingerak. Alright, tap him out. Sup? Just streaming for my birthday. How is it 6.30 already? Oh my god. There we go. First stream yours was Smash Bros. Raw 2009 Championship Mode with Kurt Hawkins. That was so long ago! Yeah, why the hell was Orton a cruiserweight in that game? Because he totally is not a cru He's six foot five. Oh, fucking, this is... Was this Engel's last game? Or was... No, no, he did make it in 2007, right? Just barely? Or am I crazy? I don't know. Orton and uh, Angle are both pretty good characters, but Orton... Or sorry, Angle's definitely better in this one. Bad sell there. Alright, I don't know if I'm gonna get him to tap out. He's not very hurt yet, and he has, like, a 10 out of 10 submission. Yeah, he got out immediately. Oh, 
I don't like the looks of this. He's got the fans behind him. Yeah, I am starting to get worn down. I'm going to store that finisher. Fuck. Okay. Superstar who said his success goes straight to his head. The contempt Kurt Angle has for his MDB stream. Awesome. And the WWE fans is just unbelievable. Nice. Angle knows he's just about the best there is. Why shouldn't he have contempt for superstars? Oh, Eddie Guerrero. That's a tough one. Give him the respect he deserves. Ooh, nice power slam animation. That's a good looking one. Hard to time it though. I'm gonna try for that one again. Get some practice on that. Oh fuck, I gotta do it earlier than that. Okay. Good luck when you get to Triple H, I know, right? I'll need it. There we go. The big belly to belly has been putting down a lot of people. Oh, what uh, match mode? Slobber knocker. Every opponent has like very little health, but you gotta do a gauntlet of like the whole roster. We gotta beat 50 points to get the challenge. We just barely missed. That would have been a pin for sure. Shit! Come on! Come on! Damn it! There we go. I reversed him. Fuck, he took me down. These superstars are so unpredictable. This match could go another 30 seconds or 30 minutes. I hope it's the last Oh yeah, there's that never-ending neckbreaker that does shitloads of damage. That might put him away. The rest of the night. Oh my gosh, this could be the finisher. One, two, oh, thanks for the anonymous uh, gift sub there. I'm just fucking... Ah, he countered the RKO. Shit. Shit. Yeah, nice try. Ah. Roll him up. Oh, just barely got that one. Oh. Danny Basham. Okay, it should be an easy one. Should be an easy one. Just gotta be a little cautious, you know? Nice. Yeah, we need uh, 19 more points to go now. Oh, RVD! I didn't think he was in this one. I thought the previous game would have been his last for a little while. Although he did make it in that one WWE game. Uh, was this Magic vs. Raw 2010? He was in that even though he wasn't on the roster. I think he was in fucking Impact at the time. There we go. He's down. Nice. Okay, who's getting this next RKO? There's a short time limit when our momentum is full like this. There we go. Quick knockout on Chris Masters. Come on. Hey, Edge. He's got pretty good stats. Is Lashley in this one? Uh, no. What was his first one? Uh, 2008? I'm gonna say 2008. Nice! I didn't think I was gonna get him with that. Wow, we are getting beat up, though. HBK. Okay, he's good. Again. Belly to belly. Would you argue Edge looks better in this than 2K19? Uh, or is it 18? Uh, whatever one... There was one of them where he had the really weird eyes, right? 
I think that was a few of the new ones where he's got the crazy eyes. There we go. Put him away. Oh, Shelton Benjamin's out there. This must have been his last game for a while. Oh, no, 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 no. He was in a few more after this. What am I thinking? He was in Smash vs. Raw 2010 as the gold standard? Alright, Batista's pretty tough. Fucking low blow. Oh, it's Batista. I hate him. Batista was a fun wrestler. I thought he was pretty good. Very quotable. A lot of funny quotes from that guy. Basketballs don't hold grudges. He's done. Chairs aren't just encouraged. They're allowed. Muhammad Hassan, this was definitely his last game. Oh, that's a good power slam. Haven't gotten the pin with it yet, though. Give me what I want! Oh, sorry, there's so many good Batista quotes. Get up. Get up. Ooh. Ooh, my stomach's growling. I should eat soon. Big suplex. There we go. Any good wrestling games last few years? Uh, yeah, the new Fire Bro Pro game is really good. That's on Steam. And PlayStation and stuff. I thought 2K19 was pretty fun. 2K20 is pretty glitchy, though. Against Christian again, we're starting to get repeats. All right, get up, get up. We need 11 more points. We need 12 more points to hit 51. Hind and Reich again, that's fine. Oh, you know what? He could have been in 2007. I just forget. He was in a few games. Oh, I thought I had that one. Come on. There we go. First, first birthday stream since finding you. That's awesome. Internet's most wholesome content. Thank you. I don't try to. <laughs> it's just people say that a lot. Damn it. Oh shit, he actually got me with that grapple too. Fuck. Oh, if I get to red body health soon, things are gonna really go downhill. Congratulations on the goals. Thanks. I've been working hard. Fuck. Just pin him. Okay, okay. We need 11 more wins. Oh, hey, Shelton. Ooh. Fuck. We're good, we're good. Do you like the movie The Wrestler? It was okay. Not a fan of wrestling, but you appreciate the movie? The movie gives a very unrealistic view of what it's like to be a wrestler, but... It's fine. I think it was a fine movie. That's the thing, is like, some people go thinking like that's what all of wrestling is like, and that's just not even remotely true. It's very one... It, it's it's similar to a very specific kind of story that very few wrestlers seem to have lived through, you know? That's... It's not... Some people go thinking that's that's what there is to wrestling, and there's much more to it than that. Ah... There we go. Is it more akin to redneck anime or redneck soap opera? Both are completely inaccurate because it's not even remotely redneck. Yet to keep in mind that professional wrestling is enjoyed predominantly in many countries across the world. 
including uh, Canada, including Japan, you know? Places that do, that do not have redneck in the way that you might think redneck. They definitely have rural areas, but it is not at all a rural thing. It's an entire form of art with many genres within. Shit, he's kicking the shit out of my knee. There we go. That did almost nothing great. Oh, Stevie Richards out there, and I think I saw Triple H, which isn't good. He's got the best stats in the game. Fuck, yep. That didn't hit. Yeah, we fight repeats. Holy shit, what was that? Someone gifted 50 subs. Little Llamas just gifted 50 goddamn subs. Thanks! Uh, I hope everybody enjoys your emotes you just got. Uh, that's a fuckload of subs. Jesus Christ. Oh, hey, MSX. God, how did he not get knocked out from that? There you go, guys. Enjoy your subs. Oh, don't stand on that, Sabu. Staying on my phone for a second there. Oh, buddy, you want out? Okay, let me just show you to the camera real quick first, because I know they're going to want to see you. All right. Hey, buddy. Hey, buddy. This is Sabu. There he is. Hi. Oh, you're so tired, aren't you? Okay, I'm going to let you out. There you go. Hi, Sabu. Going? Are, are you going? There you go, buddy. Buddy, don't stand in the doorway. Come on, come on. He's not very courteous yet. He hasn't figured that out. <laughs> oh. Ooh, it's getting so hot in this room. Getting hot, getting muggy. Ooh, road to two, uh, 250, might need to get changed. I was at, um, when I checked earlier today, I was, ah, God, Stevie. Fuck. Fuck. I was, uh, I was against, uh, sorry. I, I was at 175 when I started the stream. So I might be there, I don't know. Respect the beard. Thank you. I, I do a lot to mainstay. I got some new beard oil today. I talked about that in my uh, vlog over on the YouTube channel. Your birthday is Thursday. Awesome. Happy birthday tomorrow. There we go. That's got to be it, right? He's pretty hurt. There, we finally got the pin with that. How's the beard been growing? Looks like two years of work. Oh, I don't know. I cut it all the time. I just have good beard growth. Oh, fuck. It's Triple H. He's really good. He's got the best stats in the game. Okay, we're good. We're good. Get in the corner. Get in that corner. Lucha! Fuck. Almost. Oh, my head is up to orange damage. Oh, that's another 10 gifted subs there. Thanks, uh, Scarrow. Oh, Jesus, hold on. There's there's even more. I need a second to read that. Oh, God. Oh, God, no. We have red body health. This could be a loss. I need to be careful. Fuck. Fuck, he got his finisher. Oh, no, that's probably it. He knocked me out. Shit, I was so close. Oh, I got... I, I still got an achievement, though. Okay, whatever. I still got a challenge. Shit. Uh... Oh, it scrolled off screen. Hold on me. Gifted 10 subs. Okay, okay. I... Okay. I think it was the gifting of 10 subs. I think I understand. Oh, 30 was the highest? I could have sworn 50 was the highest. Whatever, we did it then. Yay, we did it! <laughs> Oh, 
Oh, whoop. I meant to save there. Yeah, how dare you be generous, motherfuckers. Of course, Triple H ones, yeah. Can fight a million people. Triple H, though, one pedigree. It's all over. The reign of terror of mid-2000s Triple H. Yeah, yeah, Triple H's reign of terror was still very much alive and well during this time. Hence why he's got better sets than the fucking Undertaker. Yeah, I think I saw the 50 in the time as well and got confused. Well, we did it. We we killed the score then. We did good. That's awesome. Oh, now, as much as I'd love this birthday stream to go on forever, I'm boiling. I still have work to get done today. I'm starving, and I want to spend some time with my wife tonight. Uh, so I think I'm going to get going. Uh, gonna start wrapping this up. I don't know if I'll continue playing this game on the stream. I already have so many other things to work on, you know. Uh, so maybe. I don't know. I do really like the game. Uh, check your, check your sub count live? Yeah, sure, I'll check it real quick. Um, that's weird. It's not letting me, um, shrink it by double clicking. Huh. Uh, I need to go to this page. Insight channel analytics. I don't know why they moved it there. Subscriptions, 171. That is not accurate. Where's the accurate one? Down here. 263. I guess the next thing I need to move it up to is 300? I don't know. I don't think it even tells me anymore what I'm aiming for on my thing. So I'm just gonna move it to 300. Thanks, everybody. I appreciate uh, that. Thanks for all the happy birthday wishes. I'm gonna go get working on some other stuff because I still work on my birthdays. That's just... Now I am. Thank you everybody so much for watching and until next time, have a nice day.